you so you had a kid playing soccer, volleyball, and football, and and obviously to some extent you you paid attention to the coaching, and 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 obviously also you're talking about guys and girls, and there's maybe a difference in coaching boys and girls or men and women. How involved or how hard was it for you to not get involved, especially probably in the football, being with your background? That's a that's a good question. I I tried not to get involved. It's easy in a sense once you say you know I'm not going to be involved. I'm turning my son or daughter over to coach so and so. You know, and I'll come watch the games. I'll cheer, uh, you know, when appropriate, you know, um, give solace when when appropriate to, you know, but but you watch, obviously. And certainly with football, because of my background, you know, I, I did early on when Andrew was a freshman at Stanford, he ultimately redshirted. Jim Harbaugh was in his second year, if I'm correct, at Stanford. And, you know, he thought. Um, they ended up redshirting Andrew. And I do remember Jim calling me up before the season started and the redshirt rules were different then. He couldn't really play at all. And now I think he can play like three games or four games or something and mm. then still get a redshirt, which leads to kids having like seven years of college eligibility. But anyway, you know, Jim called me up and he said, hey, um, you know, my coaching staff has a difference of opinion. Some of us think that Andrew should be redshirted. Uh, some of us think uh, he's ready to play. And I said, Jim, it's up to you. 